Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And uh, one little tip for those that uh, will continue using the Mail app transformed, of course, into the Outlook app. So that, first of all, that double, um, you know, kind of loading of app will eventually end when the Mail app is officially retired and that Outlook will be the only app. But one of the things you can actually do, so there's a simplified ribbon at the top when you have the Outlook app um, at the beginning. That's the way it will actually be there for this app. Now, there's also an option in the Outlook app that will let you have a full ribbon, just like you could have in Outlook. And the, only, the, the way to actually turn it on for those I wanted, upper right corner, there's that little down arrow, which are options of the ribbon here. You can actually click on this and choose classic ribbon because there's a simplified ribbon and there's a classic ribbon. The classic ribbon will open up the ribbon to what is a much more interesting ribbon with all the information visible and what you can do. So this is... Uh, of course, a little bigger, so it removes part of the visibility of what you have. But it does have the ability and the interesting side of having every single feature, you know, talked that, that, that are visible. And actually, it's written what they actually do. So this is kind of cool. And there are more options than the simplified ribbon at the same time. So depending on what you want to do, depending on how you use this app, you can actually go back to the simplified ribbon or the classic ribbon, which is a much more extensive ribbon for the features. So it all depends what you want to do. I like the classic ribbon, even though it does take a little bit out of the space of visibility. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.